and the tweet went, and good. So Great. now I'm gonna gonna type a message in the chat. Okay, my name shows up pink. That's pretty good. Slyo9 is here, and he should be a mod. Yep, I I have the line. I'm gonna pretend that people will show up or filter in as we start going. So uh, I'm just gonna yeah. get to it. This is the arena, that thing what I do. <laughs> and joining me tonight, my name is Kaz. Uh, joining me is Slyo9. Once Hello. More. We're playing Druid. Yeah, trees, yeah. <laughs> Can Oh, do, do I just pick the biggest card every time? <laughs> every time pick I have a the choice. the biggest card and pick the, uh, the innervate. Okay. Well, biggest card is Defender of Argus. This will let you make uh, your I, jokes some more. I like him far and away better than these other two. He's, yeah, he's also much better than every other one of these. Um, Where is this biggest pick makes me cry a little? I, I think the crocolisk is all right. Yeah, but, let's let's not right. stick to a gimmick. Well, I should more firmly establish the gimmick before I go in on it. River crocolisk is a fine man. Wow. Hmm. Wrath is kind of good. It's between Wrath and Spellbreaker. I think Druid, Druid has extra shots at silence. Yeah. And Wrath is really good. Yeah. I don't need to hear more than that. Oh no. We can build the deck from yesterday. <laughs> Do you like to play with fire? I think I like to play with fire more than these other two. The cards, others. So. Because sure. this is a druid, you're gonna you're bound to find bigger and better things than solid snake um hmm I, I i don't think this is hard frankly like yeti is good beauty big bodyguard isn't so much and murloc raider really isn't so uh so yeah let's have a yeti yeti all twos and fours all the way down Ooh. <laughs> all twos and fours <laughs> uh, let's you have a shot at at the auctioneer. <laughs> I'm gonna pick the auctioneer. Yeah. That'll that'll kinda guide us towards spells. Pyromancer favors that as well. Mm. Um Ooh, so does spell damage. Is that flat <clears throat> I don't I don't think it's actually better yeah, than Yeah, I would say better than Earth and Ring Farce. No. <laughs> We're picking him. All those spells. Yes, we're seeing many spells. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't mind another crocolisk. That'd be all right. Yeah. Sure. Take care of annoying paladin tokens. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> well, we have a big spell, and a, a not actually that impressive spell in mm. savagery. Yeah. And then I mean, the savagery looks really good on the turn where you bite, but having the pick between the two is like, ugh. Right. I'm still willing to pick the truck, I think, being that I don't have that many threes. Also, maybe we see and plus also... two, plus two taunt, or plus oh, plus four taunt. Yeah. And... Demolish them. Okay, yeah, I was, I was, okay, I was right. I had to look it up to make sure I was correct. Savagery used to hit all minions. Oh, good lord. And cost two or three. So. Huh. Well, so, anyway, looking at these... Um, I, I think I can take Ancient Mage here. I mean, I like Sun Fury Protector as, what, the better River Crocolisk? Yeah, it's basically a better River Crocolisk. <laughs> My guys could wear Taunt pretty well. It, I guess Sun Fury Protector also gets to tell the joke. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to pick plus. Ancient Mage. I'm... Can Ancient Mage tell the joke? I'm certain that uh, it's not as funny when he does it. Okay. He well, tells let's... he tells it all wrong. I, I'm still going to pick him, imagining that I will pick up more spells that deal damage. There will be spells right now. Okay. No, well... like sooner or later, I'll, I'll get another crack at spells. You know, Lord of the Arena is not the worst card in the world. Big man. Don't have many of those, and it's yeah. competing with kind of mediocre creatures all across the maybe, board. Maybe we'll be able to turn him into a tree. Hmm. Maybe I'll feel terrible once I get an actual tree, like now. Like now. 
Like, oh no, tree and innervate. Uh. Well, trees before innervates. Yeah. Okay. Tree. Swipe. Swipe. There. Swipe. Gonna, see now, all that spell damage will look good. Man, ancient mage swipe. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you're bored. Uh. Hmm. I'll I'll pick Mad Bomber. Yeah. It's the most functional out of all those. Hmm. Uh, More spell damage, loot hoarder, and not terribly impressive three. Funnily enough, taunt isn't the hugest thing right now because you can hand hand it off. Mm. I can hand it off to an ogre mage. I yeah. set of ogre mages. <laughs> well, another chance at bite, which is a good removal spell plus light. Yeah, it's a war leader's helix. Mm. Young Priestess would be my first one drop. I'd be all right at that. That's true as well. I'm going to pick Bite, though. Stick to the middle. Hmm. Uh, I'm going to pick Mark of Nature. It's a spell. It is a spell. It's... I want it on the truck. One of those hey. all important sources of taunt. You mentioned having more options in silence. This is and... more or less what I had in mind, and I'm going to pick him. Keeper yep. of the Grove is great. I'd like him. Another tree. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> sure. Yeah, trees. <laughs> They'll never expect the third tree. Well, Yikes. I don't think I want to be Arcane Golem. No, that doesn't feel like this deck. I could possibly be stampeding Kodo. Like, he leaves a body behind. Hmm. I like that better than Abomination. Yeah. Like, A-Bomb is good against one or two decks out of all of the character classes and all the decks. But stampeding Kodo is good against way more. Right. They're both at the same slot. Uh, we can fill out twos. Um, Brew. Gurubashi. Gurubashi. I don't have weight. Well, I could I could give him taunt or some stuff. You don't have a ton of ways to interact with him. Uh, you have a. I have an earth entering farseer. I have a mad bomb. <laughs> and you have wrath. Oh yeah, wrath my guy. Draw a card. Hit you for five. Wild pyromancer. <laughs> mark of nature. Hmm. Maybe you have more That's wings. That's not the worst. Let me pick the Gurbashi berserker. He can get really nuts. I think I finally get to pick innervate. Yeah, you have enough eights and things, and even worst case, you have an auctioneer. Worst case. I think I could finally pick Innervate. <laughs> yeah, you have a lot of eights and stuff. Yeah, the, worst you know, case, you have, like, I have an auctioneer. Oh, how badly do I want spells? It does flat I'm always really it, sad to be holding natural eyes. <laughs> yeah. It's like, yes, I've finally gotten, I've finally run my opponent out of cards. And yeah. then, oh no, they have a minion that I have to deal with. Maybe I will have the minions that they have to deal with and pick yet another River Crocolisk. Except for this one, slightly better. And by slightly, I mean much. Huh. It's honestly between Dragon Lean Mechanic and Healing Touch. Healing Touch. touch. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm sitting there eyeing the Healing Touch. Healing Touch is not bad. In some crazy... I mean, you do have eight toughness of mm. tree to heal. Mm -hmm. You do have a number of cards that already interact with it. I'm going to pick Healing Touch. Stick to spells in as much as I can. Well, here's the Dragon Lean Mechanic that I am missing. <laughs> Do I want the two even more? I think you're pretty heavy on four right now. I really am. Look at all that. I'm going to pick Fairy Dragon. Let's even that up a little. I'm... Hey, <laughs> speaking of four. Keeper of the Grove, number two. I would take many of them. Oh, man, Mogushan. Should... Yes! <laughs> oh, right here. I'm not picking him, though. Let's... No. Gonna... Well, you could make your own Mogushan Warden. Yeah, no kidding. I don't know if I can pick the second Mark of Nature, though. I mean, much as I like this card, that really requires you to have a minion. And I can't guarantee myself that, especially since I've started picking, like, Innervates. I'm going to pick Flesh Any Ghoul here. He is a creature. Ah, oh, dang. Keep my creature count nice and healthy. 
Ooh, I could pump Oasis Snapjaw up to the massive 211 with Taunt. Look at that mug, Sean Warden. <laughs> uh, you know, is Rifleman? Rifleman is fine. Like, sometimes you need one more damage, and, you know, with the Druid power, that's... Yeah. Which isn't on display on the screen anywhere. Um, gonna, Hidden. Gonna pick a Rifleman. How many Keeper of the Groves is too many? Many of them? I like all I of them, I to be honest. I don't know. I know there's a Nourish, though. There is a Nourish. Also, Knife Juggler is nothing. Uh... He's, he's fine. I don't like him in this deck because he's he's here so late. This is also my last card. Yes, this is... I this didn't is, even realize. That was, the reason I was sad looking at 28 was... Uh, or the 29th pick was we don't have any of the, the bear... The Druid of the Claws. Yeah. But it's kind of rough. Nourish is one heck of a reload. I don't think we have any, and I mean, it is the third keeper of the grove. <laughs> and as much as I love breaking the rules of constructed Hearthstone, yeah, I think it's time to be more reasonable and pick the Nourish. So that's a deck. I ended up with okay. two innervate. I ended up with a constructed deck. Okay, so how about um, you go ahead and, on like turn one, innervate twice in a nourish to draw three cards to mulligan? Is that is that the game plan? Like burn three spells <laughs> for no reason. To, to to draw three spells. Yeah. Oh, okay. No. Or if you you know have uh, auctioneer in play, you burn some spells to draw six cards. <laughs> well, let's get it started. All right. Here's to early yeti. Turn two Yeti. Turn one Yeti. <laughs> that's that's my yes. favorite. Uh, that's my favorite play off the Innervate early. If you don't have the Druid of the Claw, I have two keepers, so that's <laughs> all right. I have one swipe. That makes me nervous. Would have liked more spells for spell damage. No but... kidding. Went in on the Ancient Mage, and for what? <laughs> All right, Priest. First opponent, AFTW. I think you can keep the Keeper. He is a Keeper. Mm-hmm. Also, I think the music is messed up. Why does it still have the selecting card track instead of the getting ready to fight track? Or maybe that's only playing for me and everyone else hears the, the correct thing. Okay, now here it goes. Okay. We're into it. Hey, look at that draw. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Improvement. Upgrades. It limits what your opponent can do this turn. And there are a lot of things you might run into a river clock list. And hey, combo. <laughs> uh oh, free. I like the combo. That's... Huh. Um. Well, you can bump it and shoot it, or you can bump it and hero power it. Hmm. Do I really Either... care? Like, I might wait a turn and silence it. Just yeah, bump attack him, him yeah. and play like another crocolisk. Sure. Yeah, I mean, my I board. Think... Worst case is what? Uh, Shattered Sun here? And that's not it? Alright. Okay. Um. Well, now I could Rifleman and Bump. And then... Or you could attack it with your face. Ooh, that's true. And of the still, play another... still play another River Crocolith. <laughs> Sweet. Let's let's do all of these things. River Crocolith. Look, two threes are really powerful. I mean, he's gonna trade his Jungle Panther, right? Like that's that's gotta happen. Or a card. Like you don't get to keep a five one. He could also heal it. I'd be okay with that. Oh, all right. Ooh. Okay. I think that's fine. You, you have good trades with it. Hell, 
You don't, again, your hero power. Oh. Well, I don't really want to take that much damage to the face. I'd rather oh. Ironforge Rifleman and then bump the 2 1 River Crocolisk in, play Mad Bomber. How about you bump the 2 1 River Crocolisk in, then play the Mad Bomber? <laughs> See what the Mad Bomber says, and if he doesn't oh, do Lord. the job, you can follow Well, up. I do have a backup plan, okay. That's... Right, because you have a backup plan, this plan isn't bad. You know that he is going to murder my river croc. Let me attack with this river attack crocolisk yeah, before he just dies to Mad Bomber. One, two, three. One, two, three. Here we go. That is a fair bomber. I will, I will be dingied. So now I guess the question is, yeah, just punch him. Again, we get to save this Iron Forge oh, oh. Rifleman for... And the, uh, the bigger Iron Forge Rifleman if it comes to that, <laughs> come to think. This guy has another ability. Yo! Hey. <laughs> Ugh. That's large. Um, well, hmm. I can throw my board into it and leave myself with a 2-2. Two -two. That sounds kind of poor. You can... Could flat silence him and just... What if you what if you shot it with the keeper threw the bomber and your face into it? Mm. That would be my mana for the turn. Like that's yeah, that's full I'm mana. That's more of a board after that. That's that's fine. Okay, now we do this. He's gonna think I'm crazy until this happens, and this I'm gonna have to do carefully. Okay, let's deal two damage to that. I'm always nervous when I play those cards. Choices. I like the Nourish Innervate here. That's... <laughs> Draw something and then... Oh, look, I can actually play it. Oh, oh no! The my second! My source of silence. Fine. Whatever. Draw your other one. Dang it. Eek. You could... If you draw three cards and draw into the keeper, I would be able to innervate into it. Yeah, let's let's try it. Draw three cards. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Nope. Uh huh. Nope. Oh, that's interesting though. Huh. How does innervate Argus sound? Well, it sounds like I'm throwing away the River Crocolisk. And then dealing some damage with Keeper of the Grove. Hmm. That gets him to four, five, yeah. That would put his little guy pretty small. Down to a one, one. I mean, the alternative is I just let it run me over for a little bit. Right, hmm. like you... Go to the face with your guys. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> So a Keeper of the Groove and a River Crocolis walk into a bar. Also, the bar is called your face. <laughs> <laughs> what are they? That's a good bar. Hmm. Okay, immediate death. Oh, no. Ooh, yikes. Yet another immediate death. That's Don't a, like that. That's a little scary. So we can't heal. Well, I'm in Tree Town. <laughs> I could pop off the 4 2 and enter Tree Town. Yeah, you mm. can also. Deal 2 damage to the Light Spawn and bump it with. Uh... What, Stampeding Kodo? No, no, no. Deal 2 damage, one with Iron Forge, one with your face, and then attack it with the uh, Defender of Argus to kill it. That's and the then he le he has a four two and I have nothing. Well, you have a two one and a two two left over. Oh oh, I see what you mean. You don't lose Argus yeah, on that. Okay. Uh, is that better than just a tree? <laughs> Tree's a good one too. Mm. The I guess the the drawback of tree would be uh, name of the card Shadow Word Death. Yeah yeah, he, he, he could he could. Pop out foul language and wreck me here. Uh, every turn lasts forever because I take my time doing these things. Um, trade and tree. I'm making the original plan go. Okay. Trade and tree. 
There's also some plan where you bump into Light Spawn and play a Kodo right. to kill it. Right, yeah. I'm, I was thinking about that, too. I'd have a 3-5 against this 4-2. Might be better. Okay, that's... Okay, he that's still exactly might have... exactly enough mana for... Shadow or Death. I don't actually have... Thank goodness. Oh, great. Okay, um... Now you get to bump tree and he play auctioneer and heal tree. <laughs> oh, I like that. Yes, that's that's eight months. Let's do that. And as much as I'd like that tree to go to his head, it's a lot better to get that off the board and heal up and get some cards. Because he is not in mind control. Oh, wow. Yeah. Well, well, look at that. <laughs> hey. You also have lethal on him next turn. Uh, 12 plus hero power plus that Ironforge Rifleman finally doing <laughs> his job. Beautiful. How did so, I ever deal damage to my opponent? When did that happen? Uh, Man. Your Crocolisks uh, <laughs> were around for a while. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Okay, silence. Then he heals himself, right? Oh, no. no. Oh, he's... He's gone? Is he? I think he's just gone. Yes! The rifleman. Uh, he's d he's mega gone. Look at all this. Oh, man. What? Yeah. Let the rifleman do it. <laughs> what? Forget that. I'm doing it with my face. Okay, fine. At least let the rifleman participate. There we are. <laughs> okay. <laughs> rifleman got the kill after all. It finally did something. <laughs> the Iron Forge Rifleman, even though I... Ooh, quests! Yes, I'm, I'm satisfying quests without even really meaning to. Mm -hmm. Eep. Because you, you're a little low on gold. Uh, you could probably use the... Yeah, I, I need to... <laughs> need to, do, need to keep have, on top of that. You only have enough for, I think, what, like 15 arena runs there. And no, no, not even. That's a little low. I don't know. <laughs> The freaking 12 win one got ya. Yeah, no kidding. These, like, huge sacks of gold. <laughs> okay. Oop, oop. Pyromancer ooh. coin. Pyromancer coin. I'm gonna. Ooh, wait. That might actually be, like, the say, thing. That can reveal. Let's keep it. This hand looks <laughs> oh my goodness. quite interesting. <laughs> this is suspicious. Coin into nothing. Well, do I need to hold up Pyromancer coin? Hmm. I think you've got the mark, and that's. Yeah. Okay, the question Let's is if you. It. Yeah. I'm yeah. I'm gonna run out the Crocolisk. That was what I was gonna suggest: was holding the Pyromancer and. Even if he plays a creature with three toughness, you can bump it with your hero power plus Crocolisk. Or if he does that, you know, you just mm. get a trade and everything's fine anyway. Yeah, the question is if I hero power or pyromancer now. I I think the pyromancer's fine. Make the trade. Sometimes a pyromancer is just the blood fen raptor. I know. Sometimes a pyromancer is better than a blood fen raptor. And very rarely it is worse. Yikes. That's fine, though. Because you get to just bump it. Hmm. 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 Yeah. Make sure Pyromancer doesn't, you know, off himself accidentally. <laughs> I'll give, give you a little pick-me-up, buddy. <laughs> I like the fact that that also adds three power to the board. That's that's the more. Oh man, I hope you have to like healing touch just for one damage everything and oh, healing. Oh man, nothing. I want him to put like a two toughness guy, two health guy on the battlefield. Even like shield master, you'd be able to. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. You see, I can choose whether my spells are spells or not. <laughs> Also, it pops up whenever you have one of these choice cards. It pops up with two. They, they they look like spells and they have names. It's very suspicious. Ooh. 
Uh, all right. Flip your coin. I win ah. the flip. <laughs> Beautiful. Won the flip. Mm. Oh, you could. Mm, uh, you want to do that? You could like plus four power and go to town. <laughs> That's. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, with the tree in hand and nourish, I I don't know that I need to do that. Also, there are a million cards that make that a terrible <laughs> you idea. Punished like seventy <laughs> times all over. I think but... I'm gonna I'm gonna be hero power and okay. like not that's... spend cards. Play it a little safe. Let's <laughs> let's not go crazy. Watch that be the like correct thing to do. Your opponent just has it's, nothing. Sits here. there and makes no creatures that can interact with a one. Okay, there. Okay. Fine. Um, wrath and hero power. I like that. Yeah. Wrath first, cause card. Right. Deal one damage. Draw a card. Like wrath or would you like cast wrath? It's a I yeti. It's open for rifleman. Armor's really good. <laughs> Armor's pretty cool. Lets you go above 30 health. Mm -hmm. It also prevents you from taking damage. Like, if if a thing says deal damage and then... Water elemental. Yeah, and then things, then you don't, you don't actually get frozen. Okay. All right, you can... I think you can <laughs> respond in kind. Oh, I can definitely do that, baby. Let's, uh, let's cast Moonfire. Sure. Yeah. Your opponent already played a sweeper. Right. And if he has the, what, forked lightning, forked bolt? Yeah. I mean, that could kind of get me, but I still have a creature left. I mean, hmm. Yeah. Also, we're getting close to, to tree town. Hey, he can have earth elemental right soon here. Let's see right. How he he also, how big is that? Six. Hmm. Nope. <laughs> I saw you point at him. <laughs> you don't get to do that. Let's see. So that would let me take out the... Oh, well, I'd, I'd lose my keeper if I do that. Right, because that's just a little too much. You could... No, oh, and you can't do it to Fairy Dragon. Yeah. Right, right. You can't be the target. Let's see. Is Keeper worth that trade and then like just play a Yeti and kill off his totem? Hmm. The question is whether Mark of Nature is worth that trade. I think that's all right. I, I have I have big things to do later. It's... Yeah. And you already did get card out of uh, that ability. And a Yeti. Yeah, once you hit 8 mana, the uh, ogre can stick around as a uh, secret for swipe. Yes! <laughs> like we play kobolds, except it's a 4-4. Four -four. Yeah, it's, yeah, except for it's huge. <laughs> it is also a threat on its own. Okay. I haven't managed to pull many cards out of my opponent. That's very true. The overload and... That Twilight Drake, as well, caused him to play much more mm. cautiously. At 8 mana, this could be <laughs> uh, loads of... Okay. Okay. Oh, man. Hey, burn a hex here. That seems great. Oh, even better. Um. Okay, well... We do... Fairy Dragon, two damage through the Ogre Mage in. Yeah, and then... Like hold off on Tree Town. Yeah, try to... If you, you burned a Hex that easy, might be holding more. And if he burned it on a 4-5, he might burn it on a 4-4. Four, four. Also, you get some Taunt here, so you get some Frogs. Cool. <laughs> 
Yeah, you must attack the frog. <laughs> its name is just Frog. No, it's just Frog. It's a beast. It is. What is uh -oh. it sitting in? What the heck is that? Oh! Uh oh. I have a feeling he rolled well. What is this? Every time the air totem comes up, it's like, uh oh. Something bad's going to occur, right? Yep. Straight lightning bolt. Man. Not possible without the one and four. And that looks so much worse. Oh, no! Oh, no, I'm a fool! <laughs> uh, let's no. see. If you care to take damage to save your... Your 2-1, mm. swipe plus hero power does the job. And you do have the health to spare, being at full with a healing touch. Mm. I also have the, the refresh. Let's let's do all that. Yeah. Man. Man, was... rolls oh. into that Wrath of Air Totem and everything. I just... Yeah, because without that, instead of... I guess the big thing with that is that he, to kill his, the 4-4, four four, he has to burn both the fire elemental and the bolt. Okay. My opponent has assured me that that was a mistake. <laughs> I don't believe it. I mean, we'll see. What, does he have 24 damage in his hand? Through a taunter? <laughs> I get through the frog first, buddy. It's tough. Ask the hard questions. We're in this portion of the game where our opponent is only holding copies of Fire Elemental. Okay. Ah! Uh, Super powered, four, kill five, it off. Six. Hmm. It's not the best use of mana, but it certainly just kills that. Yeah. And that's he, fine. Which is good seeing as he actually presents eight power right there on his board. Hmm. I'm gonna save the healing touch. Uh, with no minions, your opponent is very unlikely to pull twenty three damage out of nowhere. With a with some minions, your opponent's a lot more likely. <laughs> Yeah, then it's suddenly... Oh, by the way, Wind Fury! Blood, yeah, blood Rush. Ah! Blood Lust, not Blood Rush. Blood. 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 Throw the blood. Everyone has blood. Everyone has blood. Opponent just passes. I want to believe that my opponent can see me doing this. Yes. <laughs> you have slight highlights over what you're targeting. Okay, taunt. Yeah. Um. On that well, note, now. I would think that nourish is probably. Well. I I'm going to have to cast the tree eventually. Do it. I mean, he doesn't have minions in his hand, or he would have played one. Yeah. So he has spells. So one of them's probably Hex. Well, if one of them isn't, then he gets to spend, like, Lava Burst plus Lightning Bolt here, so... <laughs> well, he's going to make his Wrath of Air Totem <laughs> immediately. Oh, yeah, okay, okay, and then double bolt it. Win the, win the flip. His hand's actually just a bunch of Frost Shock. Okay. Healing oh, no, up. Healing Totem. That also puts a little... That, that upsets my plan slightly. Nothing. <laughs> but... <laughs> Got a plan for you. What? <laughs> hmm. If your opponent couldn't answer the first tree, this also sets up a really great joke. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I love it. Rival trees. There's yeah, that portion of the game where they cast Fire <laughs> Elemental every turn, and then it gets a little later, and now we're here. He'll never expect the third tree. Come on, you know you want to attack one. 
Oh man, I hope your draw is keeper, I guess. That would let you go exact lethal. What is he holding, I guess, is the real question I have. I, I mean, he's bouncing around with things. Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's nourish first, I think. Yeah, maybe something cool will happen. We nourish or nourish, and we draw, and we draw, and we draw. Oh man! <clears throat> so, <laughs> yeah, I'm greedy enough. So, a uh, iron bark protector and an iron bark protector walk into a bar. <laughs> They keep walking. Oh man, is it time for Mega Hero? But that cannot possibly no. happen. I'm Three gonna... damage to our opponent. Game ends. <laughs> Look, if he couldn't answer the pair of eight eight trees, I'm going to guess he can't answer the pair of man. He's missed the spell damage every time, and that's what he's going for, right? Mm. Okay. Mm-hmm. And then. Another lightning okay. storm. Like he basically can't use the axe. Must the sun well. Okay. Wow. One tree down. I'll be dingied. I. Oh man, never mind. <laughs> I was going to say play the man. <laughs> don't do anymore. Let's. Attack your stupid taunt man. There we go. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I think that was a little premature, but... You know what? Maybe he's, he's watching the stream. He saw that he is... <laughs> Top deck to the Iron Forge Rifleman. He's like, it's over. Iron Forge Rifleman coming in with the key shot right I, at the end. No. <laughs> it's... Two victories for Iron Forge Rifleman. I didn't even believe in this card. I guess I should give him more credit. Where where is my old guy? There he is. Battle cry deal one damage. One damage. Wait, Keeper of the Grove can go to the face? Yes it can. That card's very strong. I I see. <laughs> I I Okay. Yep. <laughs> What, what more is there to say? It's a good card. Yeah. Didn't even realize. Sometimes cards are just better. Okay. So this is the swipe game, right? Mm. Mm. With that in mind... I like Keeper just fine against this too, but I want to. Oh, Ooh, I... I have I have done worse. Yeah, now it's uh. Oh, oh now now things oh, look no. dire. <laughs> now things everything look, <laughs> look pretty bad. Attack him! <laughs> Attack him! Get, Where's the secret? Get rid of his noble sacrifice. I'll do it. Yeah! <laughs> I don't know why he played turn one Noble Sacrifice, but he did. <laughs> Nothing to protect. I don't like that play at all. No. Not at all. I guess maybe he doesn't know that you just don't have cards to play. Mm-hmm. Okay. He still could coin into huge. I think we're almost out of the woods. Huh. That's good. Coin. What bubble? Going to do another secret? Another secret. Well, um, I think we know what to do about secrets. 
Hmm. I can still play Amani after getting yep. rid of his uh, noble sacrifice here. Oh, it's not noble sacrifice this time. Fascinating. Well, I guess you make the trade, and it's probably uh, revive it at one health. Huh. Um, the next minion you play will have one health then. And yeah, okay. Yeah, that's actually the only possible one that could be left there. Mm. I think there's only yeah, there's only four. Whoa! Oh goodness! Whoa! That's a good card. Okay. Okay, I was gonna say he's not leaving a money around, right? Is Gurabashi just the play here then? I think so. I can't risk nourishing. That's you need a board. Yeah. You are up on cards already. You don't need to. I guess what, that's what happens when you can shape shift away his his cards and, oh. and his secrets just generally don't do all that much. That touch. Yeah, that's that's a little awkward. Oh. Um. You can okay. Silence death touch. I can silence death touch. And attack it and attack it. Yeah, well, Is do that... you need to kill it if... Well, I suppose not. Well, at, at the very least, I am silencing it. That's yeah, I don't think that's... Let me, let me get done with that part of the plan. Let me take the most stuff off his board. Mm. Ah, Blood Mage Thalanos is pretty good, huh? It's gotta go. I would just bump things off his board. <laughs> now that I think about it, deal two damage would have worked too. Oh, just accept the two three to my face instead. And, yeah. yeah. An extra point of damage. Yeah, I like Thalanos dead just because. Okay, okay, your guy's mm -hmm. back to a two six. Yep. Back to being mortal. Hmm. I like your next turn, though. You have a very funny joke for your opponent. I wish you could, like, tell your opponent the joke. When you oh, it. man. Yeah, nothing to it but to do it. Ooh, I also get to shoot the owl. Yeah. Hmm, or shoot the owl. Yeah. yeah. Let's, let's do it. Okay, so. A Gurubashi Berserker and a Keeper of the Grove walk into the bar. The bar is full of your guys. They don't leave alive. Yeah, we always have to. We gotta save that shot for the thirty, the <laughs> final point. Man. Like this is the killing blow. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, you even have, well, you have board advantage, card advantage. You're down on life. That's the, that's the weak spot. Mm -hmm. But you have a tree next turn. Yo. Okay, is it Consecrate Fall? No, no Consecrate follow-up. That's <laughs> that's a blessing. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> huh. Well, I could just make trades in tree. I could beat him down in tree. Make trades in tree, I think, is the safest. Hmm. Like, what does the paladin have to do about tree? He already burned a quality. Right. And leaving him with no creature for blessing of king sounds great. So, uh, well, yeah. Let's... Yeah. Funnily enough, if the 3-1 didn't have taunt, I would like it more to the face, but... Mm -hmm. Yeah, but... Because it has taunt, it would be... Oh, he's here. All right. Let's... Oh, he's he's rolling for it. What do we got? One damage. One. One damage. Oh. When, ooh, whenever it attacks. Okay, so eight points of damage for the card draw. Hmm. Oh, hold on. You could nourish into silence. I could. I think I'm going to cast nourish anyway. I don't. Yeah. Draw three cards. Okay. Uh huh. And then, okay. All right. Hmm. 
I could wrath into knowing whether or not I have silence. Do you need to wrath the minion if you have the hero power? Well, I mean, it lets me draw a card. That's that's the only reason I would do oh, that. True. Okay. I'm I'm just, I'm just looking a at the spell. I'm just looking at spell damage in hand. <laughs> I want to get I want to get like six points out of. Oh that oh, I see. Yeah. Well, in that case, I'll just play the ogre mage. Yeah. Okay. Give him a stupid card. Fine. Here you go. Have a card, guy who's going to twenty-one. <laughs> I do like Blessing of Wisdom on opponent's creatures, though. That's that's amusing. Mm -hmm. Woohoo! Hey! These are all... These are all... <laughs> These are all tiny. Man, I want to draw a swipe. Okay. Mm. Um, okay. I you can. do have a card draw. <laughs> Oh man, you can actually like an ancient mage <laughs> into four damage on the cantrip half of wrath. <laughs> that's that's good. That's nutty. Alright, so an ogre mage eye and There we go. <laughs> okay, so uh deal four damage to that. And then draw silence. Hmm. Truck is acceptable as well. Um I think I accept the truck. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you have the easy attack. There we go. And then you're already, again, you're up like seven cards here, so. Mm -hmm. We're just waiting on the killing blow. <laughs> <laughs> right here. Wait. I mean, it, it's probably, frankly, right here, but who knows. All right. All right. Random lit missiles. <laughs> oh, boy. Did that miss the tree? It it got the truck. Wow! It, it Wait, can I just kill him? I can kill him. Yeah, he's he's he, he's finished. Can I, I kill him with Iron Ford rifle? <laughs> no. Oh no! Come on! No. Come on! It's right there, man. <laughs> Didn't touch the tree. No one can handle a tree. That's not true, but I'm kind <laughs> that of... That opponent could not handle the tree. I'm playing a little cautiously with my trees. Well, you don't have four of them. <laughs> Is that a problem? <laughs> <laughs> no. Should I, should I have four trees? If I for, uh, iron bark protector. What an absurd freaking card. Like, how does... How do you look at that and not immediately laugh your head off when you... <laughs> An 8-8. Eight, eight. Huh. Okay. Well. I'm going to toss those back, keep the river crocolisk, see what we can do. Aha! Well. Well, tree is nice for later, but... Yeah, hopefully we draw Innervate, stick on two for a while. Yeah. River crocolisk. Ooh. Hopefully we get to demolish him. Yeah. Hoping for totem play here. Is... Tiny Ragnaros. Oh, he'd never do it. Not when it might get eaten by a whatever this is. I guess a crocodile with like three oh. like, sets of legs. Well, I, th I think the truck looks... Ooh. I think the truck's still good. Mm. Yeah. Hmm. When does this happen? At the start of your turn. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna take his two one off the board. Yeah. If you if you leave it, there are a lot of ways truck can die. Mm. Forked lightning. Whereas now he's just gonna complete the trade and then. Well, believe the fact that I have a demolisher here. Uh-huh. Okay. What do you got the f Wow. Okay. Wow. He wanted that truck gone. He knows what's up. He's no fool. 
Hmm. That's think... just gonna eat a an axe activation. Yeah. So ghoul. Whereas is the... this, he'll have to do something. Really can't after his turn is gone because of overload. Yeah. All right. Cool. Oh, well, here, here's a fact about flesh eating <laughs> ghoul. Uh, I'm sorry. Frankly, I don't know what totem would have been good for him there. 1-1 one, one would be... No, you just hero power it out of the way. Yeah. None of them. He I, he must just not have anything to do on 2. Was he going like, to coin bolt? Wow, no oh, fear. Wow. That's good. Those axe activations need to go. Ooh. <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh, oh. oh man. I'm definitely doing that. Yeah. I guess I could also yes. throw down Fairy Dragon, because if he kills it my ghoul still gets bigger and he takes three damage. I like that. Yeah, let's uh let's make him feel bad. I mean, that Earthen Ring Farseer was actually doing nothing if he, he didn't attack there. It wouldn't have healed you. It wouldn't have healed anything on mm -hmm. the board. Lightning. No, a Yeti. Um, you still have a good trade. And it makes yeah. your ghoul six power if you, if you do the Keeper plus Earthen Ring. Hmm. That'd be good. What else can I do in that turn? Hero power. Hero power. All right. Deal two damage. Do not silence Yeti. Yeah, seriously. Yep. Of course. Hmm. All right. Now Ghoul gets to hit for a quarter of his health. <laughs> and this is a fire elemental. Fire Elemental would be a Grumpus. Guess I'd have to play one of my own. Right. Then Gurabashi into that wouldn't be the worst either. Yeah. If it's not Fire Elemental, that's great. Okay. Taunt Totem does nothing against the board. <laughs> You're kidding. I get to kill my opponent with Flesh Eating Ghoul? That doesn't happen. Okay. Oh, no, okay. Right. Wow. <laughs> I mean, eat the hex. That's. I feel great about that. Alright, is... I'm gonna go for mana efficiency with Gurubashi hero power. Okay, that gets in one point of damage and gets Gurubashi on the table, which is... Is our opponent still have the coin? I think so. Mm-hmm. Okay. Gnome just finished a run. A 6-3 run. Congratulations, Gnome. Opening up a hex. My monsters grow. Okay, that's uh. Uh huh. Uh huh. That's more of a threat. Hmm. Well, let's see. I could. Hero power, take out the two one, Lord of the Arena, Keeper, Attack. and. Kurabashi into uh, Gadget Sand, because I don't want that to live. I think that's what like, it has to be. Any any plan that I have involves this attack at any rate. So, sure. Let's yeah. go ahead and, and then all this. keep his board clear. Yeah. Against, you know, the guy who could bloodlust me. Yeah. This, yeah. Keeps, your, this keeps your frog around, too, you know? Yeah. And then all of my minions will have taunt, and it'll be great. Maybe he has to burn another hex on my lord of the arena. Shield okay. master. Okay. My guy beats your guy. You're, he is determined to have a good bloodlust. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> it keeps happening. Hmm. <laughs> <clears throat> Well, this this would mean I keep a board and he has none. And I still get a Yeti. Yeah. Oh man, the frog even gets to Yeah. Frog work. gets to trade off. 
All right. All right, I'm doing it. Okay. Here we go. Uh, wait. Can I roll that? I I could, I could eat the the mechanical dragonling. Let's try to do that. Okay, and then and, and then just play out play Yeti. Yeti. Well, I wouldn't be able to do all those things. Well, you have you have a uh, Lord of the Arena crash into, the taunter. You have mm. Gurubashi crash into dragonling mechanic, oh, and then. Yeah. And so not tell him the joke is what you're getting at. <laughs> next turn. Next turn. Next turn. Well, it can be a better joke. Can always be a better job. I don't, I don't really want Gurubashi to suddenly get taunt. He has enough power as is. Whereas Yeti suddenly becoming a 5-6. Five, six. Five, yeah. six. Is there actually a 5-6 taunt creature? Because I'm pretty sure there is. Good! Stop Jesus. making so many damn creatures, okay. you. Coin, Coin into yet another creature. It has to be Bolt or something to not die. Rock Biter weapon. That, that doesn't not die. You have a lethal on the board. Oh, please. Come on, Rifleman. Well, it isn't, but uh, I'm gonna take the kill and, and all yeah. that, so... Yeah. That's four in a row now. Nobody wants you to have the killing blow. All concessions all the way mm. down. I actually like that better when opponents, they're like, oh, okay, you've got to leave. It's yeah, just, they, they, just they concede, know. Just concede. It's much more polite. How is this deck so good? Man. Ironforge Rifleman. The thing is, it doesn't look like anything special, you know? I think Double Keeper of the Grove is is it's the biggest power you have. I guess. I have a lot of versatility. I mean, well, okay, I'm a druid. You're a druid, <laughs> is what you're saying there. <laughs> oh, no! My zoo is the best. Congrat <laughs> Congratulations to Abyss Hut and telling better jokes than I do. I should open yeah. a concession stand. But I'm. Oh! The zoo is great. <laughs> you want to. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how about, you, uh, how about you take a hot dog and go back to the stands? You don't belong in the arena. <laughs> oh, this mulligan looks familiar. Know? healing touch going away. I've had pretty good opponents. I shouldn't disparage my opponents. Now it's ST3Go. <sighs> oh no! Double River Double Cockles. River Cockles. Oh my god. <laughs> That's... I think I do coin, actually, considering it. Yeah, I think coin into a Crocolisk is completely safe. Considering I have so many things to do on three, or two. Yeah, hopefully, hoping for a one toughness creature. Though unlikely against. Um, Annoying. you can just like bump hero power. I could bump wrath and not take a million damage. A million, uh huh? That's how much. Or how about you? Would, yeah, okay, that's it's five. It's right. five. That's a lot. Come on. I forgot. I for okay. I forgot. I quite literally forgot that you'd have to take five. I was like, you just attack it first, and then your river crocolis lives through the power of. Question mark. Yes. Okay. Ooh. You can't. You can't yeah. innervate into it. <laughs> I was. I was trying my hardest to innervate. <laughs> I'm like, ooh, no, not actually. Oh, okay. Cool. Well, I, mean... I. Wow. No, wait. Wait till you find auctioneer. Wait till you find auctioneer. Okay. Okay. I'm going to play Demolisher. I Crocodile. Mean, I can't wait until you get to play Auctioneer and then your cantripping dark rituals. Then innervate, innervate, swipe. Swipe. <laughs> okay, break that shield. And do I win the flip? I do not. Oh, no flip. Hmm. Oh. Interesting. You could... Silence off the shield. And then you'd have to bump it with your two guys or innervate in a hero power. Mm. Which probably isn't the worst anyway. Mm. Could also swipe his face. That gets the shield off and then just attack him. Uh... <laughs> 3 3 be damned. 
You I could also like bump the, the shield with the uh, Demolisher if it being at one health is okay. Maybe that's alright. Like, because then you get to hero power Crocolisk, kill the, the man, and play a replacement Crocolisk. I mean, yeah, Ironforge Rifleman, you're weak to now, oh no, but... Yeah, okay. I'm weak to Forked Bolt. Ah, not really weak. Your second creature doesn't I wanted die. to play, like, a lot of little creatures all of a sudden. Or, like, like one medium-sized creature and then a lot of little creatures. Dragonling Mechanic and Friend. Dragonling Mechanic and, like, a 1-1. One -one. Like abusive sergeant or some nonsense. Yeah, leper gnome. What do we got? Forked lightning. Okay. Okay. I mean that's that's one for one because you're. Crocolisk lives. Not not anymore. He doesn't. No. Okay. Well, he's gonna be overloaded to hell next turn. Also, I get to shoot that. Yeah, also you just get to off it. I'm gonna go ahead and do that and pass. Uh, two damage here. I'm not really interested in innervating into like if this was a tree or something then I would Yeah. Well you have to double to and would it's... be thinking about a tree turn. Alright. If you draw a tree next turn, like innervate tree is cool. Oh, your opponent's overloaded, so this turn is a Right. Plan. He 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 was overloaded into the into the tank. How about uh, Innervate Tree? <laughs> Innervate Tree kills spell damage totem? Yeah, I like that. Okay. By the way. That's a reasonable play, right? Yeah, turn six. I like your equipment, by the way. I didn't get an ooze. That's what's wrong with my deck. That's why my deck oh. doesn't look great. One of those Bloodfen Raptors. Mm-hmm. Truth. Um. Hmm. You have hero power to remove that. Ooh, we're getting close to Ogre Mage swipe territory. Uh, yeah, one turn from now. Hmm. You could nourish to see if something else comes up because hero power is something you can yeah. still do after. Maybe you get something better. Oh, Lord. <laughs> you just finish him off with spell damage. Yeah, right? Anyway, let's uh, let's go ahead and do that. Hell, you could even create the, uh, the 12 mana turn to do it all. Okay, so I think the tree probably dies here. We had a good run. Maybe I'll give him more health. Ooh, if it lives. <laughs> if. I'm expecting the axe plus something to make work. Oh, he's he's hoping for the spell damage. Okay. Wow. This is his face, yep. <laughs> oh, man. Um. No. Oh, oh no. You got a super swipe for this. I do. I think that's just the play, like four and four. Yeah. And, and then in. I mean, that's sure. his board. That's that's really great. Why not? Deal five and two. Isn't swipe cool? Swipe is pretty great. <laughs> swipe gets kind of stupid when you have even one spell damage. Yeah, all of a sudden it turns into, like, kill spell that also casts a sweeper with the kill spell. Alright, spell damage to him. Okay, no. Okay. That's gotta be the one he's looking for, right? Mm. Okay. If you draw Ironforge Rifleman, you have lethal. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, 
mean, assuming. Hmm. No such luck. Well. What could I do instead? Pyromancer only hits minions. That's not. Uh, yeah. So you can deal 11 damage, and that's not lethal. It would basically blank his axe. That's kind of cool. What if you played Pyromancer, then went ahead and did, like, the, the plus four attack and killed off his cult master with two spells? Hmm. While while going in for lethal, like pyromancer plus, uh, like one to intervene, <laughs> just to, just a cast or like healing touch on me. Yeah, one of those two, hmm. because that rats is bored in addition to you know, killing him. Okay, plus four attack, biggest man. Um, and then, uh. I think that got in. Yeah, okay. You you were you were able to queue things up and he can't use his axe anymore. That is a little nerve wracking. No fork lightning. I mean, him having that blank axe is good here. I mean, I like this a little better considering he's a shaman and I have a hero power that deals damage. Okay, okay Lightning Storm gets rid of both of my guys. That is a fact. Yep. Okay. Okay. I mean... You just uh -huh. choose to deal damage here. Mm-hmm. What the hell? Yeti and man with five toughness? Sure. Aha! Better Yeti. Mm. Okay. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> so he can use the axe. Mmm. He found it. Again, Iron Forge Rifleman would have been the hero. Would have won the game. Uh -huh. Which was won, but <laughs> I guess Iron Forge Rifleman is just the best card ever, and I think <laughs> <laughs> somehow one damage. Moonfire would be the best card ever. Yeah, I know. Even like Elvish Archer. Yeah. Paladin. Hello to Caliph, my opponent. Oh man, I have to keep the best card ever. Yeah, just get rid of the Lord. I mean, in this match, it's kill his hero power on come in. Yeah, and then maybe attack to bump off a second activation of it. That sounds yeah. pretty good. Okay. Dust my hands off, having closed the gate in time. Yep, my hero power into your face and pass. It's, would've liked a river croc lisk there, but we can't have everything. We can have nourish every single game. How about that? Yeah, I'd, I'd take that. Hey, here we go. <laughs> Iron Forge Rifleman is going to get to do his job. I feel bad not using him on the 30th point of damage, but uh, I'm fine with this. Might get in the, the second and third next hmm. turn. Okay. Huh. Um not happening. Hmm. You can off it. How important is it to kill a three three with this? It's a it's a paladin. I don't want a paladin to have minions. <laughs> At the end of the day. <laughs> it's a paladin. 
keeping a paladin off of minions is like drawing extra cards. Right. They suddenly have no targets for their stupid blessing of stupid kings. Or might. Or thanks to Divine Shield. Speaking as the guy that was running that precise deck last time around. You know, yep. that's a pretty freaking great card. Yeah. Heck, is it Nourish next turn, barring anything like a Durabashi coming off the top? It's Nourish. Here we go. Oop, don't want to end. We could innervate, but it's going to make okay. me see all these. Okay. Hey, and you got some top end here. You got removal. Like, the game knows that you your turn is going to end before it allows you to know. Mm-hmm. All right. I had, good lord, where'd I get all these? How about biggest man on... I'm, I'm fine with biggest man. Yeah. Like, he can't just cut it down with a sword. All right, he's going to need something else. And oh. what does he got? All the rules. I left him with a minion. I know. At least if he, like, makes it huge, you've got swipe to get it off the table. Mm. Man, he is spoiled for choice, just like we are. Mm. Oh, all right. It's following the rules. Oh, good oh, lord. Oh, good lord. I'm gonna keep following the rules for a while. Alright. The rules are being followed. Hey! Huh. He left you with a minion. Um. Indeed. So I could play a minion whose attack is already one. You could play Gurubashi as well. I mean, that goes down to one and then the ability still is around to kick in. Hmm. Yeah. You could Wrath to kill off Azure Drake, or... I already have enough cards. I think that's all right. Yeah. Yeah. Let's pretend that he has a spell damage card in hand that he wants to use. Consecrate. Because here, if he uses the... Uh, if he bumps his panda into your 1-1, one -one, then you can just eat it with your hero power. Or swipe. Yeah. All right, following the rules. Like, there's no way he wants to cast Aldor Peacekeeper into this. Yeah, a third freaking time. He's gonna ca he's gonna cast an Eldor Peacekeeper that isn't the face down card on the table. <laughs> so he can be the guy with three Peacekeepers, <laughs> right? Bleh. Okay, so. And then... We got Consecrate first, maybe? His own Gurubashi Berserker. Berserker. Hmm. Means he's not following the rules this turn. Swipe is starting to look tempting. Okay. This might this costs life, but to best preserve that's I guess like it would be bump, hero power, swipe. Mm hmm And then that still leaves you with River Crackle as, as follow up. That's not the worst. Also I'm at thirty one. Thirty two after the hero power. <laughs> so yeah. yeah. All that works Let's... good. Bump. Your power. Um, you want to do this first. Mm hmm. And then a swipe. Oh, right. It has to. Yeah, that's. I was a little nervous there. <laughs> the best is when they when you, there's a Gurubashi Berserker on the table and you cast, like, Avenging Wrath, the, the eight random missiles. It, Wait, each it, one counts? Each one, each one counts as a hit and it. Pauses the animation to animate. Oh, jeez. And because that has seven health, you know, it can take a lot of those random missiles and just be like, make that animation take a good 15, mm. 20 seconds. That five health is huge. Yeah.
I wonder who else I might be able to pull out of true silver champion range. Hmm. I mean, hope, hopefully what he does is he plays a, something you can bump and then you can, like, full heal it with, uh... Ooh. Oh, so boy. You've got, you got the healing touch to full heal if he lets it stick. There's Falling no up. way he does. There we okay. go. Okay. I was... Well, I thought maybe he goes follow the rules and resets it, you know? And considering we know he has that, I think it's an ideal time to play Demolisher. Right. Like, Demolisher, Hero Power... <laughs> yeah. Four, seven, nine. Perfect. Yeah. Okay. okay. So let's uh, play Demolisher. Okay. Let's activate our Hero Power. Okay. Let's chop down his minion. And then... And then a River Crocolisk and a Demolisher walk into the bar. <laughs> walk is a... They, they roll on it. Maybe the maybe the crocolis came in his truck. Yeah. He like rolls out the door and is like, "Yo." Crocolis rolls up to a bar in his truck, tears down the bar. It's like, "Yo, I already paid the cover. All right. You let me in." We need him to use that. We need him to use the peacekeeper. Justice. Annoying. Yeah. Because trees. Trees look really terrible as Mogashan Wardens. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Then again, I do have two of them. What do we do about a Defender of Kings? Five power is a lot. I could just throw the Defender of Argus into it. You could also throw Crocolis Defender Hero Power into it. No, I want to throw the hero power into his silver hand recruit. Eh, truck could do that. At, at random. No, no, no. I mean, truck could do oh, that. Oh, oh, oh! You could could bump him off. Truck could just attack it. Yeah. That again has me taking five to my dome. You do have the heal ten, or you, you have heal eleven. All actually. for the sake of like leaving mark of nature in my hand. Yeah. I, I don't know how much I like that. What if I mark of nature anyway? And kill it? Yeah. yeah. Let's... Okay. Okay, so. It's four health and taunt on, I guess, you. Oh, that was. Yeah, that was fine. And then hero power. Oh, shit. I missed. Oh, uh, you missed. You missed. I, I missed. That's. That could be. Very bad. That's probably the game. Great. Ah, plans. And here comes 12 Blessing of King. <laughs> ah. Oh no. So he kills your truck. Which draws a card. Would have still. Ah. Gets light justice, justice off the. T oh man. Oh no, he gets to draw a card off. Mm -hmm. The beginning of getting chumped right here. For duty. No, my 100% disagree at this point. Like, you play a tree. Yeah, it doesn't, doesn't really matter if I do anything. Ugh. Yeah. Gross. Gross. I already know he has the answer in hand. Well, he also has nine cards in hand right now. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> My god. Gets to cycle his charge minion. Hmm... Then Aldor Peacekeeper on the tree. Come on. There yep. you go. So now it doesn't it fails to kill a token. And trades with again Lights Justice. <laughs> wow. 
cute. Well, that doesn't really do anything. I think I'm gonna play it anyway. Like, go ahead and bump off Cult Master first. Or hope it hits a Mani Berserker. Yeah, and then suddenly I can maybe. Yeah, sure. Take his See if it hits a Mani. Maybe it's sweet. Maybe this is a good bomber. Nope. Nope. Dang. Dang. You can hero power Cult Master and innervate into the tree. And I guess bump off the token as well. That is not the worst. For the wild. Get rid of the you. Maybe you're drawing more cards. Yeah. With his seven in hand. Okay. So this tree trades with his board. Or. Something. I already lost several turns ago. I know. Of course he had a third. <laughs> how with this deck, how could he not? <laughs> Let's be honest. Now I don't even know if you win the game if you hadn't misclicked. <laughs> like you play out all each of your trees yeah, and then seriously. That. Uh, he has played Eldor Peacekeeper four times in this game. One mm -hmm. of them was returned to his hand. Coin. Coin. Ah. Ah, yes. Deal of damage. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> no! <laughs> Stop casting that card. Never. He will never stop casting. See, can I just concede here? Is that no? All right, wild pyromancer plus healing touch. Let's go. Let's get real. <laughs> oh, <Lord. laughs> and then kill off. What, his wild pyromancer? Yeah. Uh, is 2 1? 2 1, hoping he makes a mistake with his wild pyromancer. Bump into Aldor Peacekeeper, <laughs> imagining that he's going to mistakenly cast a spell. <laughs> Alright, he's only got 20 power on the board. Yeah. Should be no problem. We got this. Yeah, we got fire. Alright. Yep. Ah, but what you didn't know, it's my secret 12 damage pyroblast for 12. Just gonna... Pyroblast okay, for 18. I'm, I'm done. Good <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> okay, let's let's leave. It's a card? Okay. I didn't even want to see it. I don't I don't even care. That's You saw it. Oh. <sighs> I had trees, and he had every single answer to trees. Look. He had, he had twice as many trees. Or, no, he had twice as many answers to trees as I had trees. Come no wonder now. he just was... No wonder... I guess we should have known he had that many when he slung out the first one on your 2-2. Two -two. Like, I like if he's completely willing to use a Peacekeeper on a 2-2 two -two to make Even it... still, I played around it as much as I possibly could. Right. Alright, well, a hunter. <laughs> uh, well, actually. Yeah, with wild pyromancer around, is that keepable? I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna get the coin. I'm gonna play a Ooh. river crocolisk. Coin and a river crocolisk is, is this deck's turn one play. 
I'm working on my uh, Hearthstone APM there. <laughs> Turn one tracking. That is probably the best tracking. Right. Hi, River Crocolisk. Sure. I mean, when you have that many twos. I think so. Especially since Crocolisk is better than a lot of them. Just mm -hmm. deal with a lot of things. Heck, he can trade with Huffer. Hey! You love my recipe. Should, should I thank him? Do you just go to the dome with that and play another river, Crocolisk? I think so. Like... I mean, now he gets to trade his two for my two if he wants. Man, that's weird. Praised alchemist. Man, I almost want him to not. We must cleanse the sun well. Okay, or he goes into my other two. Hmm. And then I guess hero power plus attack? Hmm. Nope, oh, one moment. Mm -hmm. no, that's probably the best. This is not a beast, so I feel confident going to my opponent's dome. Yeah. Ooh, a secret. A shot and attack me. Okay. Let's see. What can we have? Snipe. Two damage all. I'm willing to wager that it is explosive trap. If it's exp if it's freezing trap though, see eek. what happened when I was gone. Uh oh. Well, he played a secret, shot me, and attacked me with shattered sun cleric. I'm trying to figure out what secret it is. I'm pretty sure it's explosive trap. Well, then hit his guy. Because explosive trap only triggers if you attack the hero. Yeah. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Which probably means it's freezing, mm. which is unavoidable. Right. So you should attack into it anyway. It is freezing trap. Well, there we go. Yep. Oop. And then you could just replay that crocolisk. <laughs> now I have a four mana river crocolisk. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Hello. Ah, it's back. Kill, kill command. Kill command on River Crocolis. You can't have beasts. That's his job. I guess. Let's see what he thinks of Gurubashi Berserker. Ooh. How about what about Wild Pyromancer Wrath Cantripping? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey. And then if he, you know, produces a team of one toughness guys for some reason. Aha! <laughs> Surprise. Then deal one damage. After you cast a spell. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Ooh, a secret. I guess you just attack him immediately with Wild Pyromancer to see what that secret is. Ooh, or... <laughs> If you swipe him... I could him. swipe him and then Jungle Panther and my guy dies. He still takes four. I can activate the hero power. Yeah. Yes. What? Yes. And then hero power attack him would trigger explosive trap. Which it does. Perfect. Beautiful. Cool. That secret literally just said, deal two damage to your opponent. And now you're going to get start getting, like, real taunters up? Yeah. I mean, we've taken some lumps. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. So, I feel like silencing that piece of crap. What else can we do? Fleshing make, ghoul? You could make your silence man a 2-8. Hmm. Like a 2-8 taunter. 
Do we need protection that badly? Against a hunter, I do. Yeah. Let's silence a minion. You, get out of here. Yeah. Cut that out. Plus four health and taunt. Shields up! You've got bite. You've got... What, you know, next turn, like, flesh-eating ghoul bite. Ah, random. Yeah. Mm. Oh, jeez. Um. That's ugly. Just tree then. No, it does put. Yeah, he. he... Uh, <sighs> let's him have another deadly shot and roll me over. I don't know if that's avoidable. Well, I mean, I could have made two minions. Well, you were, well I mean, okay, if you if you play Mad Bomber plus bigger the yeah. Lord of the Arena, you still get run over for six mm. damage from minions. Seven damage from minions, actually. Okay, think it's not deadly shot. Okay, okay cool. So You're still taking consider... a lot of damage. Okay, Venture Go go on. Happy about that. Yeah, Four to gone. me. So you go to five? I do do it to five. I can put on five armor, though. And I want to... Let's see. Well, okay, is... Three. What about just Lord of the Arena armor up? Like, you can't bite armor up, but... Right. I just hit him for one. The taunter is <laughs> needed. Yeah, we like taunt. Alright. No silence. If you can kill this taunter, this is the game, so. You shall not pass. His own taunter. That's okay. a hopeful sign. You can helix down that taunter, I suppose. Yeah, that, that helps me bite. Oh, goodness. Okay, so four mana spent here. I could also ghoul demolish her. And hack his minion down. Yeah. I'll, so ghoul first before anything? Yeah. Let's put you down. Is Okay, is demolisher better than just hero power? It's for, like, more health? Yeah, trying to stay alive slightly. Well, demolisher's pretty good, too. I think so. I think it is. Yeah. This also avoids explosive shot blowout. I mean, explosive shot on the left or right only kills two or three. Okay. <laughs> Shields up, I said. Oh! Alright. Here nope. you go. Nourish, nourish to drawing to three draw into gain eight, Nourish to draw into gain eight life. I would like that a lot. Gain eight life. I don't get it. Well, um making okay. most powerful well, No, I have to I have to do this. Jeez. Can yeah. I can I risk it? Can no, I, no. I mean, okay, well... You can innervate into a five. What's he at? He's at 11. Let's actually do that. He's at 11? It's not like I'm... So, nervous. innervate into Ogre Magi? Because that's lethal. Definitely. Definitely. Oh, All man. Right. I might get to escape this game. That would be... Good. That'd be really oh! good. Oh! Ah! Oh! Open up the concession stand and give that man a hot dog. Well played, Josh. You could you could print coupons for the concession. <laughs> Yikes! That was dicey as heck. 
There's so much. That's why he wasn't casting his spells. It was all minion destruction. Right. Multi shot. Another random shot kill. Like he must have drawn that deadly shot at like a turn too late. My invincible lord of the arena. Oh no, Kadena three eight one. Manifestly a better druid. This always happens. I'm gonna keep this entire hand. That's basically fine. Coin into a two. I'm most likely gonna coin into fairy dragon. To avoid I'm wrath. Gonna coin into fairy dragon. Oh man, truck. <laughs> man, Demolisher has not gotten to do work yet. No. I'm a little sad about that. Okay. Uh. Whoa. Oh. oh okay. Whoa. So he thinks he has wrath. I guess you just play Wild Pyromancer and get in. I mean, if he's gonna take seven full damage killing this and four mana, yeah, okay. There's That's... no way. Oh, please. <laughs> He's like, Fairy Dragon, I can't answer that. That can't be targeted. Claw deals with it pretty effectively. I miss Claw. I like Claw. A Claw. Claw is a good card. Inter oh, no. Hey, oh. You, you, like, can't deal with it, of course. That's a kind of Claw. Hey. You just you just kill it on board. And it's a two for two, and you get to play your uh, flesh eating ghoul before you do anything. Demolisher, you will never do anything. It's sad about that. I know, but I mean, if he's offering up his innervate and his druid for your two two drops, that's. that's I suppose that's not bad. You could make a yeti a next turn. I Oh. Okay, so now it's down to a thing. One moment. Back to being two three. Pretty sure I still Ooh, that's that's a temptation now. Hmm. Or I could eat it immediately. Um I don't need to eat it though. I think Yeti is best. Just Yeti attack? Yeah. Yeah. Stampede and Kodo takes care of it next turn, so... That would be exciting. And Yeti is big enough to almost be a two-for-one all the time. <laughs> Every time. You know, he just comes in at that size and power and health amount where you you need to spend two cards to get rid of him. Right, I mean, well, for, that... for the weight class he is. Well, here's two cards. Okay. <laughs> that deals three to... Yeah. Yeah, there's two cards. You got it. And I get to eat Come that up. instead. That's beautiful. Yeah. Let me just do that. And Flesh Eating Ghoul gets to continue uh, to stay at 2 3. <laughs> we put a big fat X over him. Silence is so goofy. Uh. It's like, what if you want to read the text on the card, you know? Okay, okay. Hero power, truck, hero power, and Kodo into his creature. Sure. You finally get to play the truck. I do. You you kill his board some more. You, you don't... You play around a starfall? Starfire? I, I, can, I can never keep the two straight. The two damage to all minions. Right, right. Like the five to one, two to all? Yeah. Yeah. Or, and then there's the five to... Something draw a card. Right, that's six months. That's Starfire. Starfire, okay. Right. Yeah. Starfall is the James Bond movie. On that... truck. Oh no. <laughs> Acceptable. <laughs> that's pretty amusing. Oh. Uh. Hmm. Is that good? Well, I want to hold on to Mark of Nature for when I can Gadget Sand and Mark of Nature next turn. Yeah, so... So maybe... this just trades with his Tiger that he's sunk things into, and I get to keep my, my whole team. 
that sounds pretty reasonable. I could do all that. And truck gets to continue to be in play. <laughs> Besides, my lords of the arena have been invulnerable so far. No! no! Okay. Okay. <sighs> oh, nah, man. That is so scary. <laughs> it's the scariest thing. Hey, there's, there's the there, star. There's the star. Okay. Yeah. And, yep, Demolisher gets demolished. Yep. Well. Oh, wow. Okay. Auctioneer is a pretty easy choice this turn, but what follows it up? Uh, Innervate first. Innervate, draw on a card. Uh, that shoots his 2-3 down. I can eat that, eat that. Yeah. Yeah, let's let's do that. Two damage. Thanks. Two that. Eat you. Pass the turn. And if you and if your auctioneer lives, which it shouldn't, hero power plus it that three. Really three. should not live. I have to start dealing with trees. Well, hero power means he can't play the eight eight. Okay. Also, your opponent no is tree. your opponent. Oh, never mind. Ah, that only was a bite. Okay. I was gonna say your opponent's dead if uh, they don't have anything to actually deal with your board, but ooh, wrath cantrip. Okay. Oh, neat. Well, hold on. What's your opponent at? Fourteen. Plus four power is ten. Eleven. Pretty sure I can't kill him. Yeah, this time. you don't have the mana to. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't have the mana for that, so I have to start thinking about his board. Which, how about um, bump, keeper to shoot, I guess on this one, actually. And then hero power. Yeah. And you could bite the... Uh, and I guess not. Nah, I'll just make a board. Deal damage. You do have cards on your opponent right now, so... The first tree that he makes is going to be pretty awkward. That's going to be about all of your card advantage gone. Like Don't if it, actually if... do that. Well, that's... Not actually a tree. Not actually that bad. Um, You trade pretty effectively. Oh, yeah. You, you actually trade that. very poor now. Yikes. Well, hero power gets an, a kill. How about a super taunter Gurabashi? That sounds pretty good. That's and eight. Then, I could still hero power. Yeah. Bump. Then taunt. I frankly usually hate doing this before the spell immediately does something, but now I take what I can get. All right, so now your opponent needs. Okay, well, that's that's certainly that's something. That is a start. What's well, the follow up? A tree. <sighs> Dang it! Crud, 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 crud. Uh, it had to be the tree. Go is the dang tree. There, I mean, there's one play I have. Either it happens on my turn or it happens on his. Yeah, and I guess do you let him make it, and then next turn maybe you draw into something more useful to kill the tree? I don't know. That also gives him the opportunity to heal the tree. I'm gonna do it. Yeah, you gotta bite. I have the way to deal with it. God, innervate then... is like the most dead of draws too. Yep. Yeah. That tree was a flat three for one. Oh no! 
end, your opponent is just seeing top end and nothing else. Mm -hmm. Okay. So just lock it away that way. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what you draw that would actually pull you out of this. I don't think ask Mad Bomber is it, but I'm gonna I'm gonna ask him all about it. Okay. No. <laughs> Stop. It was a fair bomber. Let's. 11. No, he has, he has lethal. It's, he has lethal. Exact. It's not even. Well, that tree just locked the game away. Mm. Yikes. Ooh. Shiny claw. A <laughs> golden claw. Maybe I've been playing Druid a little much. That's In we go! Alright. Trees. Yeah, sometimes you draw the cards you need right when you need them. That's mm. the game of Hearthstone. Ooh, something new. Carnabas, the warlock. Toss him back to Fender, keep the Keeper. Keeper's good. Beautiful. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Alright. I was gonna say, do we have, yeah, we have Flame Imp. That, that wasn't even like a, a question. Oh, do it. <laughs> Play your own Flame Imp. Okay, now if he doesn't trade one for one here, uh,. Then I have something beautiful to do. Right. Okay, he does it. But yeah, he does. That, that basically makes sense. I think I will leave up the opportunity. Hmm. There are, there are probably better wrath targets. I'm going to yeah. play the fairy dragon. Who knows? Oh. Maybe Kodo gets to do something. I trust the Kodo gets to do something. Well, if he doesn't trade, then you get to play, uh... Okay, he is trading. Ooh. I mean, just flesh-eating ghouls okay here? Or Kodo? <laughs> Innervate Kodo? Innervate Kodo? Sure. Let's, let's go for it. <laughs> <laughs> sure. What's card advantage? Who needs that? That's what innervate's for, getting getting this sort of thing done. He has to use that 2-1 immediately, because it loses to your hero power. Okay, or he just does that, that's fine too. Ah, that's a way to use it immediately. Uh, you've got an immediate back answer to it with the silence. Yeah, I'm, which, which I am going to take. Yep. Oh, okay, you don't know the mana for what I, I was looking at. Cool. I was like, yeah, Ancient Mage plus Wrath, yeah, but that's that's later. That's, that's that, a that, hap that happens later. I need okay. to have creatures on the board before that happens. Don't get ahead of me. <laughs> okay, fine. Well, how about you make a creature and trade with some... Oh, no, Soulfire says you don't. Well, um, I could Hero Power Keeper Bomb and that's... still play Flesh Eating Ghoul. I think that's the play. Yeah. I mean, keeping two creatures in play means Ancient Mage plus Wrath is an option, and that's sweet. That, that gets stupid. Yeah, prepare to get stupid. Alright, don't play the 6-6 six, six elemental that deals one to everything. Wind Fury Harpy. Um, I think the get stupid plan is fine just as a kill spell here. I think so. Because it deals five. No! Okay, it worked. Okay. <laughs> double double check with the wrath, but it yeah, should it deals still five damage. Five damage to a minion. I hate that bug. Cool, and you get plus one power. Zip do. All right. Okay. That's kind of big. Well, he can only kill one creature a turn. I was going to say, can you ignore it and just go to the face? I think so. Let's see. Two. 
Because we're casting the tree next turn. I think I'll hold Keeper. Yeah, as like the final. Hurrah. Yeah. I mean, that brings this guy to nine. If he doesn't do... It, he most likely has to kill Flesh Eating Ghoul here, and then you have seven... Or you have uh, six in attacks, plus a your hero power for seven, plus burn from Keeper for nine. Oh no! Unless he restores health. Okay. Well, that's not that is health not restored to the the sea giant. Hmm. What's the final card? It's a card, buddy. What you got? Handing you. Whoa. Wow. Hardcore. Right. Okay. I mean, I'm playing the tree. Question is, do I train off guys? Ah, tree, go to his face. Go. No fear. Fearless. I believe. Come on, tap. Tap out. Okay. Easy trade. Yeah, now he's making trades. Okay. He's going after my board. He left the Ancient Mage. So I need one damage from somewhere? Damn it. Well, okay, so hit him in the face and attack him and then play out a 4-4 and healing touch yourself. Just for safety, because... I mean, he no longer has a giant. Yeah. That's that's the important part of this whole thing. I don't yeah. think any arcane golem has ever gotten this much damage off. That's kind of insane. Doesn't save your life. Nope. Doesn't save your life. What's your last card? You die! Yeah, just... No need to even fuss around it. Deal two Deal damage. Deal two damage. Hi. Goodbye. And we escape the game. By dealing damage to our opponent. <laughs> By using a feature that I did not even know existed on that card. That's great, isn't it? That card is so good. A 2-4. So it's a it's a gnomish, uh, not a gnomish inventor, but the there is a gnomish inventor. No, gnomish, gnomish inventor is the one that draws a card. Except for instead of drawing a card, it immediately draws like a zero mana spell and slams it down. Hmm. Like it draws you silence or backstab, kind of. No, there's no card no. that's quite. It's like double moonfire. Moonfire, yeah, moonfire with plus one. Well, it's even called moonfire, right? Like, yeah, that's the... that's the thing that he casts. Well, toss him uh, back the ogre. Yeah, Amani's good. Hey, <laughs> oh, you know who else is good? <laughs> oh man, Amani into bomber. Hey, this guy—he hasn't been around in a while. It's... I've lost games because he hasn't been showing up. Oh jeez. <laughs> to deal the thirtieth point. You know, okay, you you play Amani here. And next turn, you could consult the bomber to see if the money works, or you could consult the uh, the, the the Iron Forge rifleman for certainty. Come on, heal yourself. Heal the money berserker. Yes, yeah, so I'm also thinking about things. How badly do we actually want to get this guy to a 5 2? Nah. Ooh, coin. Oh. We must cleanse In, what? You're what joking. A world? You just take the flat trade on. Or you play a flesh eating ghoul and take the flat trade, right? Yeah. Let's... You coin into that? That's. I have to wonder what your opponent's actually holding if that's their their line. It's like all top end and they just needed any creature. Or wait, no, things that target creatures. So now I have yeah, a vested it's... interest in not letting him have anything. 
Right. Although with most, it's going to be like power word shield, and then okay, fine. Yeah, who cares? Well, we care, but uh, and then power word shield on it right away. Okay. Okay. I would attack it. Then I actually consult the bomber first, and then see what happens. <laughs> you know that if I consult the bomber first, it's all going into flesh eating ghoul, right? I know, but I still think it's the play you make because then you know what you have to do on the rest of the turn. All right, pray to the bomber. All right, bomber. Here we just go. Don't. No. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> oh no. I can't even believe it. Bomber, you're breaking my heart. Betrayer! What are you I guess like you attacked, I, you attacked I your opponent. I failed even kill it. God. You, I mean, the only way you could have killed off the North Shire Cleric was for that bomber to deal one damage to it. There was no other way in your hand. Yep. Disgusting. I mean, you get to kill it now. I might not. Because here is another card. Okay. Like hero power plus bomber. Ugh. I feel betrayed. That nightmare ends. Um, choice of threes. Yeah, what the hell? Yeah, just get get things in play. Mm. I was very scared of like a holy nova for three damage everywhere. Yep. Yep. Biggest man. Just throwing Please. your guys into big taunters. Please. Ah, yeah. foul yeah. language. You have to shout at it. <sighs> it. What? That's been in your hand the whole time and you ran out Shattered Sun? What the holy heck? Um, Is the draw worth it here? Mm. Let's try it. Uh huh. Ooh. And then. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Fairy dragon is fine. I'm gonna do that. This could be some powerful turns next turn. Say he bumps into the fairy. He heals and bumps fairy dragon. Which is what I hope he does. Mm. Then that could set up a. Oh, I found the swipe target. No kidding. Yeah, that's just okay. like Ogre. Ogre Mage Swipe. Yeah. No question. Not even. <laughs> Please leave. You could hero power to kill that. What else is Innervate doing, right? Yeah, once we're into 8 mana territory. Right, you're already able to cast 2 spells. Yes! Yes, now we have an Ogre on the board. Yes! Hooray! Maybe the truck will finally get to do work. <laughs> God, is this just not the deck for the truck? Yikes! Alright, is our opponent... Yep, our opponent's just going to full here, so... Dang it. That's... The worst. I think it's just truck and punch him. You have a lot of reactive cards in hand, and then a blank one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mr. Gray. Okay. Pain. No. Okay. Oh. At least you got you have a good kill on Todd thing. Yeah, I'm gonna bite it. Yes. Bite hero power. Yeah. Ooh. 
wild pyromancer bite. That doesn't. Attack. That really doesn't effectively do anything more. Yeah, it doesn't Just change. Just gives anything. me a wild pyromancer with like not as much health. Well, how about bite hero power and then afterwards play the yeah, wild that's, pyromancer? That's fine. Your opponent's back at 30. Like priests do. Yep. Hey, I'm holding on to three damage in my hand. All right, that's one-tenth of his life total. Um, <laughs> Which I could incrementally hit at his two <laughs> oh my God. Well, you, can, you have silence. Yeah. That's more reasonable. That's a fine silence target in, you know, the priest deck. Yeah. Hmm. Unless... Okay, if you... That's everything out of your hand to do it. It is. There will be better wrath targets. Let's silence him. Now, where do you go... It's also, not great, but we have to, like, stall to trees, right? Yeah. Also, Auctioneer. Auctioneer would be sweet here. Holy Nova. Don't mess with Gross. Groan. Still at 30. Um... Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, you can Wrath plus Hero Power plus uh, Kodo take, to kill off. Take out his board. Mm -hmm. I, I like that just fine. Let's three damage to a minion. Hero Power, aim at you. And then... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> then everything yeah. happens as it should. I was... I was a little nervous about all those interactions, but uh, the game figured itself out. Also, holding up my ace in the hole. Yeah, all right. Yes. I believe. He can do it. Oh, please, is he looking at the heel? Oh, my God. Come on. Turn shadow form. Yes. Ooh. Okay. Fascinating. He was eyeing up his heel too much for me to not suspect yet he was doing that. Yes. Uh, by the way, that's going to get mind controlled very quickly. Just. Does that mean I don't play it? I don't. Like, what, do I, what can I even I do? Think, I think you have. Like, if you want to win the game, I think you have to. Like, what else? <laughs> like, it's most likely going to happen. He's had two cards in hand. He's just been, like, palming forever. Mm. Like, last term, he went into shadow form and pinged, and that was all he did. Yeah. There's mind control immediately. I don't really know how you would even play around it. I also don't know what you do about it, but... Ironforge Rifleman it, and... Myself some spell damage. Maybe yeah, he, he can't heal it anymore. That's that's something. Maybe he'll try. Ha! I mean, he won't. But okay. Oh, gross! This is too much of a board. Doesn't even. I can't even get value out of that. No, no. Yeah. Wait, I don't actually know how you win the game if you don't try to run the tree out there. This deck has a lot of lands against top deck, apparently. 
Oh, no end of them. Mm. Gross. He heal aid. The worst part is there's no like swipe left in the deck to actually deal with this board. No, indeed. I don't even know why I'm still playing. I should just concede to my opponent and save him some time. Save everybody some time. Yeah, let's let's forget about this. Yeah, okay. Let's. A life total alone is not going to win me the game. And yikes! Yikes! Well, yeah, seven, seven wins is good anyway. There we go. Seven and three. Let's open the key to rewards. One fifty-five. I think that's generous. Sorry, one sixty. Oh. What? God, I'm so close. That's like Price is Right. Yeah. No, no, you would have, you would have won it. Yeah. Conceal. Give me your minion still. Okay, that's that's kind of cool. It's not even. It's just like a gold. There's. It's not. It's just a common. This is just a common. Ooh. Ooh. Let's see if the, the okay, pack Okay, who is wants on. to cold shot the pack? All right, you guys got, like, a little bit here you can cold shot it. I like to think it's always on theme with the, the deck you played, so maybe Keeper. Right, if, keeper, the, keeper of the Grove. No, Gold Keeper of the Grove. Here we go. That good, huh? Right here. All right. Get your shots ready. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's not a Keeper at all. Hey! Thalnos. <laughs> Blood Mage Thalnos. Beautiful. I was oh. I was hoping to get one of these sooner or later. That's that's cool. I was almost gonna craft him, like Well now you don't even need to. Yeah. yeah. That's We did see Thalnos, so We did. He he showed up. Alright, I think I'm gonna do another one of these after a short break. Okay. So uh, we'll be we'll be back later.